you. Many people have a preconceived idea of where I come from. Some say the Bronx is a dirty community for all the trash that's thrown around in the local streets. Others say it's a very dangerous community because of its high crime rates. But only the ones that have a true eye for beauty can recognize the precious treasure that is the South Bronx. Mm. The South Bronx is a beautiful community that resembles strength for it's still fighting for a promising and brighter future. I fight for environmental and social equality because I've seen the many obstacles and burdens my community has faced. In fact, I live them every day. As a youth activist from the Bronx, I hope to serve as a positive example to youth all over the world. We're not just the home of hip hop, but we are the home of diversity and a place in which we share in each other's cultures. I just graduated high school and started my first semester in college. <laughs> I am a product of the South Bronx, and I hope to make my community proud. We must step up and take charge of the communities that we live in. The older I get, the more I realize that we are now fixing the mistakes of the past. We are all connected as a family that share this beautiful green earth. This is our home, and we must take care of it as such. At this moment, I would like to take this time to share with you guys a valuable lesson that I've learned this past year. Tori Kelly, one of my favorite vocalists of all time, wrote a song that says, people seem to think that we'll be happier once we reach the top, but I'm living for right now, because what if tomorrow never comes? Those words opened my heart, and ever since I've heard that, my perspective on life has changed completely. With that said, I would like to ask all of you for a favor. I want you all to promise that you will continue fighting for your dreams and remember that nothing is impossible. I want you all to promise that you will continue to bring about positive reform into your communities. Most importantly, I want you all to promise that you will not wait till you're rich and happy, rich and powerful to be happy. <laughs> <laughs> Happiness starts right now, in this room, at this exact moment. <laughs> So if you guys can promise yourselves that, put your right hand over your heart, and on the count of three, let's say, I promise. One, two, three. I promise. <laughs> that was amazing. <laughs> now I would like to take, take this moment to thank the Broward Youth Awards for giving me this incredible opportunity. I would also like to thank the Point Community Development Corporation for being an incredible place that promotes a safe environment for youth and even adults to express themselves. The Point CDC is my second home. The youth and staff are my extended family. I promise you guys won't find another space that holds activists, acrobats, musicians, jugglers, steppers, and artists all under the same roof. I would like to thank my youth activist group, Action, activists coming to inform my neighborhood. You guys have made me the leader that I am today. I would also like to thank my family for their undying love and support. Special shout out to my beautiful mom, who I'm lucky to have here with me tonight. <laughs> Last but certainly not least, thank you all for sharing this moment with me. It's honestly a blessing to be here with each and every one of you tonight. God bless you all and enjoy the rest of your night.